Hello, I'm Rosella Cottrell and I have a passion for parchment craft and I'd like to share it with you and today on this new to you video I'm going to show you how we use these multi-grids. These are a stainless steel grid, they've got lots of designs on them. This particular one is butterflies and it's just so easy to use I can always find the opportunity to put a butterfly on a project. So what do we do? We need some parchment paper, a little bit of tape and let's just lay it over our chosen design. This one I'm actually going to use our one millimeter tool and a little bit of kitchen roll under my hands and then all I need to do is actually just follow the design. Now I'm not pressing on at all hard, I'm going to move it a little closer. I'm just going over the same area multiple times. It's a little hard running so what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to pop my embossing tool through my Pergasoft and that will just help it emboss a little easier. There we go, that's better. So all I need to do is just follow the design. Now you need to use the largest embossing ball tool that you can for the design. You don't want to go into a large area uh, with a small tool because then there's a possibility you may perforate and go all the way through. So all you need to do is actually work your way around. When you come to the larger areas, choose a larger tool. For this body, I'm using the three millimeter tool and I'm just using those little flicking, stroking moves just to emboss that body gently. When I've embossed all over, it's time to perforate and for that I need our one needle perforating tool. And I leave my design on the grid and turn the whole thing over. I'm working on a perforating mat and then all I need to do is very, very shallowly perforate through the holes. Now I'm not putting my needle all the way through those holes, just a very tiny bit, just marking that spot because I'm going to re-perforate when it's off the grid all the way through to make it nice and easy for snipping out. So we'll just work our way through and again when we've got to the end, here's one that I've prepared, you can see that we have perforated all the way through and it would now be time to then perforate fully. Bearing in mind, let's keep our perforating tool upright and we're perforating fully. The whole of the needle is within our perforating mat and we just need to work our way around. And when we have completed that, it means it's ready for snipping out. And when you have, you're gonna create some beautiful little butterflies, just like this one which I've actually coloured with pencils and I've added a little bit of glitter. I hope you've enjoyed seeing how we use our multi-grids. Thank you for watching this new to you video.